So I'm happy and upset all at the same time. Upset because I wanted my money back. But happy because it's here nonetheless. If you guys are new, my name is Janine, and if you guys are not new, then obviously, you know I'm Janine. Welcome back, all right? Now, I love Amazon. I feel like I've preached that so much here on my channel. I have the fan going because it's hot as a bitch out here, and I can't. I don't know how I'm even wearing this wig right now. However, listen, so I ordered this rug from Amazon that you see right here, um, maybe like a couple of days ago. And it said it wasn't gonna be here for another 11 days. Now I get that because of everything, like it's, you know, Amazon has been a little bit messed up, you know what I mean? But today I went on there and I said I was gonna just cancel the order for the couch because I'm just like, all right, it's not coming right now and I can't be bothered. I'll probably just look for something else. Now I have this fluffy one in here that I'm folding up because it's too small and obviously that one already came, so it's just like, whatever. And the funniest thing happened, like when I tried to cancel it, they were just like, yeah, we're putting in a request, but we don't know if it's gonna cancel or whatever. Obviously that's why, because the shit is already here. And I'm upset because just this morning I was changing my mind and y'all said it wasn't coming right now and it's here. So I'm happy and upset all at the same time. Upset because I wanted my money back, but happy because it's here nonetheless. I didn't even get like a notification or anything to say that it's here. So like, but I'm just going downstairs to check on something else that I have coming today. And when I go down, the, when I'm going down the stairs, I see the big package and I'm like, uh-uh, I know you lying. I know this is not <laughs> the thing I was just trying to cancel. Oh, but it is. And I'm just like, damn. So, you know, it is what it is, it's here. We love. So it's gray and white, and it goes with the overall theme of a living room. Love that. So now I need to see if I can get it under like the couches and stuff, because this is five by eight, five by eight, so it's a little bit bigger than the one that I'm I was throwing out just now. Oh, yeah, you can tell. Shit, freaking stuff. I've really been working too on getting the living room together because I want it to look a specific way and just being home for an extended period really made everything like get to me so that's how I started buying all these things uh, it's so beautiful I just feel like some shit like this would definitely happen to me and I got this one because this one will be a little bit easier to just run the vacuum over and it's clean and everything so I'm just like let me just get this now I need to figure out how to lift the goddamn couch up just enough it's a lot of work okay I need to vacuum back here This was not the plan. All this goddamn man work. Manual labor here. Oh, so much work. Great, sweating like a bitch. But, I got it where I want it, and I love how it looks. I need to wipe off this TV stand, it looks mad dusty. Let me get some fresh air a little bit. So, let me show you guys the couch on the floor. You see? 
goes nicely. And I'm getting a TV stand that's like this gray. I'm not really sure how gray it is because you know sometimes when you look at it online and you get it, it looks different. So I have to wait to see. That's supposed to come today too. Can I put it together on my own? I don't know because I heard it takes a while. I feel like my husband is off tomorrow. I'll leave that for him. So um, and then the living room is pretty much gonna be complete because I have all the pieces that I actually need for in here. I'm gonna put the ottoman on this end so it could like help it to kind of lay down, you know? And I'm gonna get the TV stand too. I'll see if he could help me like rearrange the couch a little bit. But for the most part, it looks really, really good. Love that. It feels so much cleaner because I can see it's like vacuum and stuff like that. So this little furry one right here, I'm gonna bring inside of the bedroom. So yeah. Anyways, you guys, I have to take this wig off and sit in front of this camera because, in front of this fan because I'm so hot. But that's all for in here for right now. So we'll check back in. I should be getting the TV stand today. However, it's something that I have to sign for, so I think somebody might call me. I'm hoping they do because obviously just now this was delivered and I didn't even get a uh, nothing that said it was delivered. Yesterday too, I picked up a package and I didn't even know that it was delivered. Like the soaps and stuff that I was waiting for for forever. And I showered with it this morning and I'm not gonna lie, it feels really, really good on my skin. Also my oven is going off because I'm making sweet potatoes. You know, the sweet potatoes is probably one of the reasons why inside here is so hot. Also, the living room is pretty much like gray, black, white, and gold, I like to say. Hints of black hair in there, but pretty much gray and the accents are gold. I need to get a clock for hair. I want one with probably black and gold, but I'm gonna move this and put the clock. I gotta go, cause man's is playing music. Guys, this is what I got from Amazon today. I needed some slip-ons for my Toms, especially black. And I got these six pairs, I think for $9 or something like that. And then I got this. For my Apple Watch. This is the last package for today. This is my TV stand. This box was so heavy. A man was downstairs just now and he was just like, yeah, I'll bring it up for you. And I was so grateful because that shit was hella heavy. Now what I'm gonna do is, cause the living room is pretty clear right now. Light switch. So I'm gonna try and see if I can use this space to assemble it by, um. Taking the pieces out of the box exactly where they are and bringing them up in here. So we'll see how that goes, but we're not gonna record that because I heard that that thing takes hours and no. Guys, look at this living room right now. These are all the parts to make up the TV stand, right? Let me show you guys, let me really show you guys. All the parts, right? I love that it's great, really goes with my aesthetic. This is the old TV stand. But, now I have to make sure that, and that box right there has the um, hardware, or whatever. I guess the parts that I'll need and stuff, right? But now, I have to go through this little instructions manual to make sure that I have all the parts, because it says, Ensure that all parts and hardware are available before beginning assembly. So I have to now walk through and like tick off all the little parts because they're numbered, which I feel like is amazing because I've gotten things before. That little white stand back there that I have like my makeup brushes on and stuff, I remember when I got that, the parts were not numbered and I was furious. I felt like they needed to be numbered. So, so far, love this. So I'm gonna go through and make sure that I have all of them. So far, I already have one, 15, and 17. So, we have a lot more to go. Cause it looks like we have 21 pieces. 22. So yeah. Guys, so I have successfully checked to make sure that I have all the hardware. And here they are in line of the alphabet. So, we love and then I'm gonna get a screwdriver and move on to step one. So I have all the hardware and everything. I think I'm gonna be able to do this on my, my own. Hopefully I do. So first I'm gonna take part one.
guys I'm not gonna sit here and act like I'm gonna keep you guys through the whole process because just now just figuring out what age is and how to put it into number one is three minutes so maybe I'll just come back when it's half or like when it's done <laughs> guys this is how far I am with this stand it's very sturdy and I feel like I'm so upset because the people who left reviews they were really bugging they really were this is the final results you guys love it and I already put my junk inside of here but like the TV and stuff I can't move all that so now I have to wait so I'll come back when that's done but for the most part like it looks so good and I feel like it was worth my money that was my biggest thing it feels good it's nice and sturdy the battery reviews were a scam.